Oh Lens, tell me, what would Grandpa think about this crisis we have at the moment? Again, I'm not sure. It was a tough dinner. Empty bottle, half empty. But in all seriousness, um, he would tell me a story. He would say, listen, son. He would say, when I was nine, World War I was starting. Uh, when I was a little bit older, uh, the financial crash in 1929 happened. And then World War II came. So half of my life, I was in crisis. Half of my life, I had trouble and uh, not the really great life. But um, he would say, this hardened me, this prepared me for the second half of my life because I'm a very positive person, I'm a pioneer, but I did have always three principles. Number one, my family, this was important to me. Number two, um, I had my vision. I was the guy who really wanted to modernize, modern trellising. So this was our pioneering DNA of the Lens Modern family. And then thirdly, I, I, I never lost touch with real life. So for the second part of my life, I only knew one, one way. And so I lived my vision, modernizing modern trellising. Whenever you see wires in vineyard, this was this guy here. Emma. And Lens, uh, what's your vision? Poof. My vision is very simple. It always was wine, wine, um, and wine again. And I was lucky, two years into my career, I did discover that only premium and global is my life. I was very happy to have uh, a, a lot of mentors. The, the most famous was Bob and Darby, and he taught me everything when it comes to fine wine. Thank you, and I'll continue this series. Thank you.